Hi guys, this is an electrolysis setup. Uh, we're making iron oxide rust for uh, to make thermite. What we've got is a bank of six uh, battery chargers uh, set to output 60 volts, set up to about 140 amps. Yeah, we're, right there, running at 139, at about 17 volts. And the water is quite hot right now. Probably it's just about boiling. We're starting to get some uh, bubbles coming over. This has been running for about about three quarters of an hour. Uh, we have some rust down here we've made previously. It's just baking to convert it from uh, what is it, iron hydroxide into uh, iron oxide rust. And we're also grinding up some aluminum inside to uh, as the other for the other component for thermite. Let's go see how that's going. Oh, now it's really boiling over. We're putting, uh, what, about two kilowatts of heat into that. And it looks even less healthy in real life than it probably does in the video. <laughs> <laughs> it looks fine. Actually, you know what that sort of makes me think of? Like magma. Oh, yeah. Except sort of without a, the red glow. Yeah, black magma. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it's just so horrible. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, it doesn't smell as bad as when we burnt the wood in the microwave. Yeah. <laughs> that yeah. smelled awful. We were using a microwave to uh, dry out this uh, stuff you see down here. And we used wood to support it off the base so it didn't arc, but the wood started burning. Yeah, started don't, carbonizing. don't do that. That's a bad idea. <laughs> <laughs> it was fine. Okay, I think that's starting to get on the yes. floor a bit. We should turn it off now. No, we should. There's our switch, which is just a wall board that controls the relays on the chargers. Oh let's, crap. Let's see if we can clean this up. Falling through the hole. <laughs> yeah, we're having quite a bit of trouble keeping this cool, stopping it from boiling. We might have to get the car radiator or something and circulate the fluid through it to keep it cool. You know what? I do think the idea of filling this with water and dipping that in might be good. Yeah, you might try filling up a garbage can with water and dunking the bucket in around it, into it so the heat transfers out. <laughs> okay, that's good. We got the bubbles. That's all we yeah, need. Yeah, the bubbles are gone now. Now, now the steam can flow out. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, where do we dump this? What temperature are we getting on here? 77, apparently. Well, we're trying to decide. 93. 93. That's hot. Okay, it's probably it's actually hot. a bit hotter. That's hot. Yeah. Oh, well, we're we gonna try doing this with this stuff. I don't know. Do you, um, you need to bake it first. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Well, okay, I think we got our heat situation zapper. sorted out for now. Zap. <laughs> oh, you got it? No. No, I just grazed it. Oh, well. <laughs> okay, you got the bucket inside some water with the pump circulating it around. And we're running, back running again, 126 amps at 17.5 volts. How come we got so little amps? I think we might need to zero the meter. Let's just give it a try. And the battery went dead. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa, don't spray. Needs it right there a bit. You need to stay farther away. Oh, oh. Uh, <laughs> I think it's just <laughs> <laughs> a horrible floats. toxic substance floats. <laughs> We're going to try to burn off some of these bubbles. Once and for all. That <laughs> will do it. <laughs> Hopefully. Yeah. 
<laughs> it's the Chernobyl solution. Just cover it up. <laughs> okay, I think we've got enough of that. Uh, it's just boiling over too much now. So I think we're going to stop, let it settle, and see how much rest we get. <laughs> okay, we're going to lift the plates out now. These are the ones that are not rusting, I believe. Yep. And they're all black. Yep. Covered in goo. The bottom's yeah. a bit clear, though. Yep. Oh, yeah, the, bo the bottom, you can see it's yeah. been coming off. Well, you know what? Let's just dunk it back in and then... Yeah. See, that one's really clean. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah, that's because that one was closer. Mm -hmm. So it does really clean the metal up oh, on yeah. the uh, one electrode. Yep. What about the middle electrode? <laughs> it's like we painted it. <laughs> <laughs> well, apparently iron oxide can paint, so whatever. Mm -hmm. And this one. And we this put one. holes in it. Oh, nice. That really worked. Yep. Holes, holes right were there. probably there already. No, 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 they weren't. No, they weren't. Yeah. Let's, uh, quite nice. Yep. Oh, yeah, you can see lots of. It's a little bit of red rust there. Mm -hmm. Holes. Yep. I wonder if we've cleaned it out. Uh, Who knows? Really, can't really tell. You can't, you can't tell. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Do it on this side. Definitely very thin right there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's good. Anyway, that was pretty good. Stay tuned for part two where we'll get the rest, uh, separate the rest out and make some thermite. Yep. Thanks, right for, wa thanks for watching. <laughs>